I think Kobe would hate what the Lakers have become. Wow. Who's Meech says he thinks Kobe would hate what the Lakers have become. Do y'all agree or disagree that the late great Kobe Bryant, according to Meech, will be disappointed at this Lakers team? I don't think so. I don't think so. Why would Kobe Bryant be disappointed in this team? Even when you break it down to, to the elements that we have. We know what Kobe is about. Kobe is about winning. Kobe is about competing. Kobe is about family. Right or wrong. And he's zero tolerance for, 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 for behavior that's just like not professional. How many people do we have on the Lakers roster right now that are knuckleheads or causing problems in the media? None. So that wouldn't be an issue that Kobe would have a problem with. When we talk about competing, the Lakers, I know they haven't made any moves in the offseason. We keep talking about that, but they still have the same core that went to the Western Conference Finals, went to the playoffs last year. Nothing has changed. And uh, they got a big win open tonight versus a very competitive Minnesota Timberwolves. And the Lakers are not even full rostered. So being a competitive team, the Lakers still show that in a sense. So with that being said, why would Kobe have a problem with that? Uh, third, family. This whole LeBron James, Bronny James, this is probably what Meech is probably alluding to at the end of the day. But you think that Kobe Bryant in his mature, in that lane that he was in, you know, after basketball, you think Kobe would have a problem with Bronny and LeBron making history with the Lakers? Really? I ain't got Kobe doing that. I ain't got Kobe doing that. When it comes to Bronny James, a lot of y'all just are continuing to paint this narrative that Bronny James' presence is preventing someone of real credibility to play on this team, and the Lakers should be winning. That's the storyline y'all keep painting, and I just don't see it being that simple. And I believe Kobe Bryant, if Kobe was alive right now, Kobe understands the assignment. Kobe also understands that what the hell would you be expecting out of a second round 55th pick? You think Kobe wouldn't want to get his daughter into the W? She was on her way. Now, that's a little bit different scenario than what we have with LeBron and Bronny, but Kobe has always been about his kids. He's always been about family first. So when you look at, at what Kobe has been about, really for the most part, he, I don't think that he he would uh, hate what the Lakers have become. For what reason? Outside of being disappointed that they don't win a championship. And, you know, only one team can win. So Kobe's going to be pissed like that regardless, unless we win. We, we got his guy, Rob Palenka, running the team. Rob Palenka is making the decision. So what are you saying? Kobe it, it would be, would be uh, disappointed in Rob? Maybe, maybe not. But, you know, to say that Kobe would hate what the Lakers have become, I seriously doubt it, man, because the, the, the Lakers overall didn't have relevancy when Kobe left. It wasn't until 2018 when, when LeBron came back. And, you know, then we got Anthony Davis. They were able to get a title in 2020. Um, so I don't know. I, I think the Lakers are in a decent position. And they have a little a little bit of a sign of a future with some of these young guys that we got, like Dalton Connect. Like, Kobe would love that. Kobe would love that. What, what guy on this Lakers team would Kobe not really fuck with? He already dealt with D'Lo before. If Kobe could deal with that young, immature D'Lo, I think Kobe could deal with anybody on this team. There's nobody on this team that's going to cause a – who's causing problems? So I disagree with Meech on that note alone for real. I think Kobe would definitely uh, like the vibe and the direction of this team. You know, Kobe is always going to be about winning. Ain't no ain't no doubt uh, in his mind about that. But, you know, Kobe is a family man. And if we're talking about this scenario right here,
LeBron and LeBron, I don't think Kobe would have a problem with this at all. Keeping it real. For all the latest news and debates on the Los Angeles Lakers, be sure to subscribe here to the Lakers Land platform. Also, don't forget to check out our playback room for our free VIP watch parties to all our Lakers games and, of course, the live Lakerland podcast. That's playback.tv slash Lakersland.